The Lifetime Achievement Award is a way for us to come together and share the amazing impact that certain individuals have been having throughout our communities in our nonprofit world. Bring a lot of nonprofits together and celebrate them and give gifts, but we wanted also to identify uh, someone in the nonprofit community uh, each year who really stands out and has had a lifetime of achievement in in helping nonprofits. Now, we haven't given it every year. It's it, it, it's a high bar to uh, to earn this award, and uh, it, it's uh, pretty easy to give it to Pam because she's she's had quite a lifetime of work in nonprofits. She goes to a nonprofit, does a wonderful job, sticks with it, brings her passion and drive, just just delivers uh, on the mission and. Uh, She's done it over and over, and I've gotten to watch her at two different nonprofits for six or seven years in each case. Her health situation and her work is one and the same. She was diagnosed with breast cancer back in 2010, went through the process, had the treatments, and then had a recurrence uh, a few years ago. So now she's living with stage four metastatic breast cancer, which currently has no cure. To be able to be in the office every day to fight through her fatigue, her, her side effects from her treatment, her fear of her scan results every few weeks, it inspires all of us. One of our values at Coastal is to be bold. And at Komen, there's a bold goal to reduce the number of breast cancer deaths by 50% by 2026. And so, uh, you know, being bold for Coastal is all about being innovative and doing things that people say couldn't be done. And at Komen, this is a, this is a huge goal, and, and we've got to find the cure for metastatic breast cancer. Pam is an inspiration every day when you can talk about her stories. We've read different articles. You've seen it for those of us that have had the pleasure of being able to really see her work and you see how her strength continues to build through whatever obstacle was put in her way, but yet she's still there trying to help the next person. That's inspiration and that is what we're so thankful for Pam Cole.